So YouTube, generally speaking, I don't especially like meeting celebrities because I feel like I don't necessarily have anything important to say to them, but that's what I tell myself. I guess the real reason is probably because historically speaking, I've just said really stupid things when I meet celebrities. Like when I met Mandy Moore and creepily sort of like hit on her. And when I met Miss America and said such weird things about my dating life that she sarcastically suggested I write a book about my dating and then I did, so joke's on you, Miss America. But even though I don't necessarily like talking to famous people, I really like standing near them creepily and just sort of observing their behavior. Also, that's my impression of Almafy. Meeting Charlie is so cool. Like so last week, I was in New York City for BEA, aka Book Expo America, aka BookCon. And I want to contrast two celebrities I had contact with. The first, I'm not going to tell you his name because I'm going to say negative things about him. But I walked by as he was signing books, and I walked extremely slowly and creepily so that I could observe his behavior. This is one of those times when I guess it's kind of good to have one leg because people aren't gonna be like, oh man, that guy is walking slowly and creepily because he wants to stalk that celebrity. They're gonna think, oh, he's on crutches, he has one leg. That's probably his like top speed right there. This particular celebrity might as well have been wearing a sign on his forehead that was like, I'm not happy to be here. I think I'm more important than all of you. And he was just like signing books like, hey, okay, yeah, all right. Now I wanna contrast this to the next day when I was walking along the trade show floor and I stared at this man who was walking towards me and I initially was staring at him because he was gigantic. He was like so tall. I was like, what? But it turns out that I continued to stare at him because it was Jason Siegel. Or is it Jason Seagal? No, that's Steven Seagal, the directed DVD. Karate Chop Man. So I immediately started walking way slower because I was like, oh, here comes a famous person, I'm gonna watch him. This woman who's walking in front of me recognizes him and she like totally fangirls out. And she like clearly wants to ask for a picture or an autograph, but she like can't even articulate the words. She's like, oh my gosh, it's you. I, uh, uh, are we allowed to, I mean, can we, uh, can I do, can I? As she stuttered and didn't know what to say, he's like, well, we could hug. And then he reaches out and just gives her a side hug. And it was just like, so nice. But this happens right in front of me and I'm still doing my like creepy slow motion walk towards them. And I'm about to like run into them. And Jason Siegel sees me and he's like, takes her in the side hug and sort of moves her over. And he's like, let's allow this guy to pass by us. <laughs> so I didn't quite bump into him, uh, but it was very close. I think our, our shirts may have brushed each other as I walked by in my slow motion creepy, I'm watching a celebrity side hug a woman who's fangirling face.